as we head towards the start of summer. This was beautiful. All near four Patterson, New Jersey students and teachers honoring an educator who's been in the district for 50 years. Yeah, Ms. Bessie Ames began teaching in Patterson in 1974 and is now just a few weeks away from retiring. Pix 11's Katie Corrado joins us live from outside School 10 with more on today's celebration and the legacy Ms. Ames mm -hmm. leaves behind. Casey, Kate, Katie. <laughs> Aaron and Candace, everybody deserves to have a teacher like Miss Ames, somebody who has dedicated their lives to teaching and has inspired thousands of students, even some who have gone on to be teachers themselves. Thousands of students have come through Bessie Ames' classroom since she began her teaching career in 1974. Yes, I have taught generations of uh, students. Over the years, she's transitioned from blackboards and books to whiteboards and tablets. What remains unchanged was her love for teaching. It's the interaction with the students and being able to come to work and just teach someone that really wants to learn. But after 50 years in Patterson schools, Miss Ames is packing up her classroom for one final time at the end of June. Her current third graders, along with district staff and Mayor Andre Saya, took time Monday to honor her decades of service. It's very rare that anyone works anywhere for 50 years, let alone in a classroom. So anytime we can celebrate an inspiration to thousands of students, we take full advantage of that opportunity. She's kind and whatever I need help with, she will help me. I love Miss Ames, she's so pretty and I love her kindness and energy. Miss Ames developed a hands-on approach to keep students motivated and engaged. Sometimes that meant bringing in PB&J sandwiches for a science lesson. The bread, the peanut butter, the jelly, you know, the core of the earth, you know. So kids learn that way. Her approach inspired several former students to become teachers themselves, some right alongside her in Patterson. This school alone, there's a good three. And now, as she gets ready for a well-deserved retirement, she hopes to teach one final lesson. Enjoy education. That's, that's the most important thing. Miss Ames says that she's now planning to hopefully write a book in retirement and she is going to be doing a ton of traveling across the country to places that she didn't get to see while she was in the midst of her career. She says her first stop is going to be Chicago. Reporting live in Patterson, New Jersey, I'm Katie Corrado, PIX11 News. The Wendy City.